uh, for folks that don't know what a five by five is, every uh, once in a while we welcome uh, members of StoryCode to come up and present a project that they're working on. The idea is five slides in five minutes. Uh, it's a good way to kind of share uh, projects that are um, in process and to kind of ask for, uh, ask for help from the community. Hi, I'm Caroline. Um, I'm a photographer and an interaction designer for IBM Watson. I work in conversational analytics for chat robots. Um, but I started my career off as a uh, portrait photographer who I worked primarily in large format and medium format photography. So this is an image I took. It says, I write the verses other people take credit for. It's across the street from my favorite restaurant in New Orleans called Moripa, on Burgundy Street between the streets of Piety and Louisa. The street right before Piety is Desire. New Orleans is both a poem and a story. So I'm really sort of obsessed with this question. Um, this is my aunt taking a picture of my grandfather who's now deceased in the Gulfport Yacht Club, which was destroyed during Hurricane Katrina, and he was a Commodore during the years of like 1995. Um, I've taken a lot of images of my family, our homes, and the southern Gulf Coast. This past August was the 10-year anniversary of Hurricane Katrina. And so I'm sort of exploring this idea as what does it mean to be um, a modern-day southerner, and what does it mean to live in the Gulf Coast as it's slowly sort of disappearing uh, through the amount of hurricanes we have year by year. So um, I want to, I'm starting this idea, this documentary that cap captures the magic of Louisiana and Mississippi, but that isn't these of the southern wild. So what is the future of documentary? This is my grandmother. I want to make an interactive documentary and um, game experience around my family as well as our stories. We've been in the South, particularly in the Gulf Coast, for nine generations. I want to combine video and large format photographs to create a nonlinear portrait and narrative of my family as well as New Orleans and parts of Mississippi. I'm really intrigued by this idea. What is the future of documentary? And can you make a video game experience a documentary? Um, actually, I'll go back for a second. So my grandmother actually was in Gulfport when Katrina hit, and she stayed there for five days um, afterwards. We weren't sure if she was alive or dead for the first three days of Katrina. My family had evacuated to Houston, um, and we couldn't get a hold of her. And so around 10 days after Katrina, um, my father and my uncle went into Alabama and then drove to Gulfport and dropped off eight generators uh, for all of our family, friends, and evacuated my grandmother. Um, so why story code? I'm looking for a collaborator. Um, and, in, and any sort of information, I guess, around 3JS and VR, I've not really worked with that before. I've made a lot of work in Unity using C Sharp. But I kind of want to make the push to the web and sort of create a VR experience that can be experienced on the web. Um, I'm also looking for community feedback, uh, user testing, or rather critique, um, and opinions. I want to also incorporate a layer of data around the disappearing coastline. So that's something that I'm also currently collecting with um, sort of some scientists I'm reaching out to in New Orleans specifically. So get at me. I'm Caroline. And uh, this is this next weird project I'm starting. Awesome. Cool, Caroline. Thank you.